Quiet on set, alumni in action. I'm Michael S. Marker. I am a first year at Michigan State University's College of Osteopathic Medicine. I'm studying to become a DO physician or a doctor of osteopathic medicine. My name is Brittany Essenmacher, and I'm the Executive Staff Assistant to the Dean of Communications at Michigan State University. Michael and I met our junior year. He would call me pretending like he didn't know whether or not we had homework, and, <laughs> and then it quickly kind of figured out that, okay, maybe he's not calling me for homework anymore. I was much more swapped. <laughs> uh, while I was in high school, I knew I wanted to do something with science or medicine. I just didn't know quite what. So I decided to go to uh, Bay Aranac Career Center and I took a health tech class with uh, Mrs. Dory. And she was amazing. She taught me so much when it came um, to professionalism and uh, just the actual subject of medicine. And professionalism is definitely the key. Um, when I was in high school, or doing, when I was in Bay Aranac, I thought professionalism meant they want to make me a cookie cutter person to relate to the professionals and the fields that we wanted to go into. Uh, we learned how to dress, how to do interviews, and how to do job applications, how, how, you know, how to act in front of professional people. And I didn't see the value then of what it was. But when, we, when I got into college and I had to start using these skills, I realized that professionalism is the language that people use to you know, be considered colleagues. HOSA has been invaluable to my life and I'm so glad that I did it even though I didn't directly pursue a health field. Um, I have so many more professional skills than I would have and so much more confidence than I did before I met um, Amy Dory, my advisor, and really got to experience what HOSA offers and that's real world experience. Um, they're asking you hard questions about who you want to be and who you already are. I just want to say that it's okay to not know and have all the answers right now and to really, really um, think about what your strengths are, what you're really passionate about, um, and really understand that you can do so many things with that. Some advice I would give to anybody, whether you're a junior or senior in high school or in undergrad, if you want anything to do with uh, the medical field. Go and work or volunteer at a free clinic near you. I did this in Chicago, and what you get out of it is more than just something you're gonna throw on your resume. What you're gonna see there is real people with real health problems who are in dire need of health care. And so when you are bogged down by assignments you think, why am I doing this? You're going to remember their faces and know that these people depend on you. The second year around, senior year, we end up on the same medical reading team. Partly because I did it, I did awesome at it, and Brittany wanted to coast on my yeah. coat. Can I just say that I made it to nationals the year before yeah, you? Yeah, yeah in biomedical debate, so <laughs> if anyone's coasting, I think it's you. <laughs> like these like huge epiph epiphany moments that we had, it was just that like every day was so fun. Oh, it was a blast. I think it, I think you're right. Um. <laughs> Um, and then we're going to Were we on medical reading together? Yeah, we were. got second place. Whoa. That was a really good one. We are HOSA alumni. It's alumni.
<laughs> I can't even say it. Alumni. Alumni? Alumni. <laughs> Alumni. Alumni. <laughs> Alum. Alum. Nye. 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 Alumni. There you go. We, we are, are Hosa, Hosa Alumni. alumni. <laughs> <laughs> Alum. I get it. <laughs> we, we are. are. <laughs> We, we are, are a Hosa, Hosa alumni. alumni.